Hello guys and welcome back to another World of Tanks. This time I am my E75. Uh, it's a beastly tank. It's top tier in this match. Um, and there is another beard on the other team. B for my name. Um, he's also in this top tier tank. Uh, yeah, so the E75. Tier for tier is one of the best tier 9s, it has to be said. Uh, this isn't an absolutely amazing game, but it's a fun game and it does everything the E. It shows you pretty much exactly what the E75 is capable of. Um, good, good, great armor and a good gun. And this pretty much perfectly shows exactly what it's capable of. And now this guy is. Um, Signaling for more support, uh, and it's not not the best showing down this side, um, but um, but it's we're capable. We got a tier seven, lowest tier, but it's a tiger. Um, not sure what's behind me, but we do have an artillery in support as well. So. Um, as long as the, the main force of the enemy team doesn't come down this way, we can, we should be able to hold our own at least. Yeah, so I'm just pushing. I'm top tier. I'm going to be quite aggressive, especially in the E75. Uh, you don't have to worry too much about being um, um, taken down too quickly in this thing. Right, so just staying here just to do some spotting, maybe get some side on side on shots. Uh, and these two are playing very aggressive for the lowest tier. Uh, so I thought, well, I can't let them show me up. This is one of my favourite spots on this map to come anyway. Um, you can get some side on shots into the city or the town rather. Oh, and there we go. <laughs> That's my enemy, this the uh, other beard guy. Uh, seems to be coming this way. But um, before he gets here, I'm going to try to take episode shots on these guys. And <laughs> that guy took a big hit. That poor panther. He's regretting that decision. I'm getting some shots taken at me. Uh, annoyed. But there's some damage on the enemy top tier tank uh, and it looks like I'm gonna have to do some more damage to this guy he is the top tier he is a dangerous guy uh, and I know I'm leaving my um, and I know I'm leaving my teammates down this way uh, to uh, f try to fend for themselves against uh, another tier 9 but um, this guy is could do some serious damage to me later on if I leave him alone. Um, and the enemy team is winning um, by quite a bit. Um, but it looks like the uh, oh that was unlucky. It looks like the enemy has decided to push me or push on down this way rather than uh, try to take that guy out. There you go. Ugh, oh, another miss. Uh, unfortunate that one. Not quite as unfortunate as the last one, to be fair. So yeah, this has got very good army. Just have to angle it properly. This guy is trying to well. And again, I'm not sure where that went. Really unlucky. Really unfortunate not to get the kill shot on that. Um, as you can see, there is a small, and it bounced off his gun mantlet. Awesome! So we're wasting a lot of shots here, and I'm finally getting noticed by the, uh, getting some hit hit by the on the side by these two other guys. Ah, oh, and again the trashing shot. Gonna repeat. Ah, oh, get hit in the side. Not having a good time. That bounce the shot from this guy. He's pushing. He's crazy. I'm not sure what he's doing. Um, I took off a large chunk of his health there in one shot. Uh, B for my name is doing what he should do, really. 
um, and not going full head on to try to kill me. Uh, and this T29 is now actually thinking the same thing. Hopefully not taking any side shots there. I'm just going to go in, ram this guy to death, and I've got my shot. And there we go. Uh, B for my name will probably try to flank me if... Uh... Oh, he did actually pen me that time. Did a little bit of damage. He's got to get try to get up behind me. He is faster than me. And again, I'm going to go for the ram. Try to track him. I've tracked him again. Uh, yeah, he's not having a good game. He's going to find it hard to pen me now. And I've tracked him again. I feel bad for the guy now. Uh, I've tracked him pretty much every shot or every time. <laughs> I have... I put him out of his misery. I was thinking about rounding him again. Um, yeah, and now it's 9 for 9. We're pretty equal. Um, hopefully with the art artillery. And no one's going to come up uh, to take out the artillery from this side anyway. So he should be able to hit home on those guys. Um, so there's never... Another tight, low tier guy. I'm kind of. I'm just gonna go for the ram here. Uh, oh, but he tracks me, and he manages to uh, try to escape uh, or angle himself. I just go for the kill shot. Might as well. Now it's ten for ten. That ah, oh, that f uh, fast light tank is going for the RT. I'm hoping the RT's got one in. Uh, the barrel to take him out. If not, it's not the end of the world if he takes out Artillery. Well, they go out together. Kamikaze type thing. So we're now 11 for 11. Um, and I'm going to go for... Uh, I can't remember what I do here. Do I go for the... Oh, it's... I think this might be it. I think I might just leave it here. Um, and let my other guys take them. those two last two out. Now I go for the um, the cap. Maybe, yeah. The enemy There's no point in going for the cap. No, I, I've, I don't normally cap because uh, why? Why deny some people some extra damage? It's a tier eight as well. We well, did a bit of damage to like tier nine, but I'm not going to get there to do any more damage. But. As you can see, quite a fun game, that one. And pretty much just showing you what an E75 can do. Not much uh, not much of uh, the normal ammo left in my uh, thing after taking all those shots out of tier 9. See, not particularly high, but over 5,000 damage and over... Th just under 4,000 um, block damage, so great armor, good gun, and a lot of fun. Uh, so I've always to get this one, guys. Hope to see you in the next part. See ya!